Welcome back everybody to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan, and tonight I wanna to talk about, continue talking about Scream 6, but really I wanna talk about is Sydney's role in Scream 6. You know, we we haven't had too much information about Sydney, and where Sydney kinda of left off her story in Scream 5, it's, it's kind of a mystery, right? We know that she's married. We know that she has kids. Uh, we know that she has a husband named Mark, which is Mark Kincaid from Scream 3, which has been confirmed. Um, and there hasn't really been a big talk about Sydney and what she's going to actually play in Scream 6. We know that Nev Campbell has announced that she's not going to be in Scream 6, so we know that, right? We know that Sydney's not going to be in the movie, but she is mentioned in the movie. If you follow leaks and you're a big fan on Twitter, you know about, you probably most likely know about the guy named Viewer Anon, right? He is a big leaker when it comes to movies and TV shows and video games. I always mention him on this channel. But something interesting about Scream 6 is, you know, it's obviously continuing the story of Sam, right? And she is supposed to be the new final girl. She's supposed to be the new Sydney. She's supposed to be the one to kind of carry on the torch and continue on with the legacy characters, right? Her, Chad, Mindy, um, Tara, right? These are supposed to be like the new founding, the new founding members of like who our OG is going to be in the future, right? I mean, obviously the OG, which, you know, I'm, I grew up with the original movies, so my OG will always be sydney and dewey and gail and randy and you know but you know kids today or you know gen a younger generation today they're only gonna know really these new actors right and actresses and so sydney isn't really you know a lot of like i said a lot of teenagers and stuff they're attracted to scary movies right i know i was when i was a teen and i remember um, going and watching Scream 4 in the theater. That was the only Scream I ever watched in the theater was Scream 4. I was, I think it was 13, 14 when I saw it. Um, but yeah, I mean, it was, it was awesome. It was cool to see the, see the movie in the theaters. Uh, one thing I will say is that because this younger, you know, this younger generation doesn't really know, you know, who Nev Campbell is, you know, they really only know the newer actresses and actors. And so it's kind of a struggle with Sydney because we want her to be in the movie and we love Sydney, but at the same time, you kind of want her to live her life, right? She's been attacked by Ghostface all her life, right? She's been running from this evil and now it's kind of been passed on to Sam. And, and so I'm curious to see how she's going to play a role, but speak going back to what viewer Anon was saying is that um, he actually leaked that if you, Follow of you right now, and he he leaked on Twitter that uh, he talked about how Sydney is going to be mentioned in the movie a few times, um, and her role is very minimal to a sense that she's only going to be mentioned, and there's a whole reason behind her. And I guess Gail mentions her in the movie of where she is and what she's doing, and then also um, I think there's another part where she gets mentioned a few other times. You know, and how 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 can she not right like? She's the whole reason why this is all happening, right? Well, Roman's the reason why this is all happening. But, you know, if you go way back, it was her mom that got killed by Billy and Stu. And then, uh, you know, she cheated on her dad with um, Billy's father. So it's just going to be interesting to see in Scream 6 if they take a direction of still playing her as the main plot, which I, I feel is a they're kind of not doing that anymore, right? They're they're kind of moving away from the Sydney character, which is sad, you know, but it's okay. I mean, she had her time, you know, she had five good movies. Will they get her back for Scream 7? We don't know. We're going to have to find out maybe next year or after if they immediately start filming Scream 7, which I'm I'm assuming they will, you know, in the next in the summer, I'm assuming they'll do a Scream 7 and oh, well scream six does but i know for a fact scream six is gonna do well i mean it's supposed to be the biggest scream opener in all of history right now so 
I'm super excited. I can't wait for the movie. We're almost there. We're 21 days away. Uh, we got a couple weeks left, guys. So just hang in there. Uh, we're going to make it there, and it's, it's going to be exciting. So, But as always, guys, let me know what you think in the comment section below. Uh, what is the role of Sydney going to be in this movie? Do you think that she's going to have a big role, even though she's not going to be in it? Do you think she'll be mentioned just minimally? Like, where do you think the direction they're going with the movie? And I would love to hear from you guys. But as always, guys, if you like this video, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.